Thank you. Oh, you, you were finishing up that story. Art, Artie, if you just tuned in, we're t we, we've been talking for 40 minutes about Artie and John and their <laughs> show they did this weekend. So after the whole thing, I get home. I just want to have one good meal, something, you know, so I, so I order some Chinese. And uh, so I sit down to eat, and I ask my wife to pour me a glass of orange juice. She pours me a glass of orange juice. I drink, like, like three quarters of it. I start to pour more. As I pour more, I notice the, the brown stuff in there. Uh, Oh, wait, what are you doing? <laughs> throw it up. Wait, think about it. I, I'm, I'm, I'm almost going to throw up. John, don't, don't. Do I, you know what you're doing? Oh, and I, 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 so. Oh, Jesus. He's raging. John, go in the, are you going to throw up? Are you going to throw up? I want to get the story out there. I want him to throw up. Oh, that's funny. What was in there? So, I go, Susanna, there's something brown in the orange juice. So she she looks at it. There are um, maggots oh. in the OJ. Are I just drank. Uh, <laughs> I just drank. I, I, <laughs> like three quarters of a glass of maggots. Oh. John's like gold dust. <laughs> John, I, uh, <laughs> really disgusting. <laughs> 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 there were maggots. Yeah, yeah. What, 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 well, uh, what, what kind of orange juice? How old was this, this orange juice? It was June fifth, as, as the uh, you know, you know, the the ending date on it, whatever. Yeah. I don't want to make you sick, dude, but maggots are born in feces. Yeah. Yeah. It, drank, like, it, like, it, it was one of those the calcium enriched OJ they make. Oh, you know? is that how they do it? And <laughs> what, it's maggot what, enriched. Oh God. Dude. Was it a big lump of maggots? They were all, when we looked at the bottom of the glass, and I just drank three quarters of it, they were all in the bottom of the glass. Oh, my God. I know. Did the juice taste funny? No, it didn't taste funny. <laughs> it was good. Oh, my God. That's awful. Where'd you get this juice? I, I, can I say the company? Why not? Yeah, it was Tropicana. Was it really? Yeah. Whoa. Uh -oh. <laughs> Yikes. I know. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I wonder if I could... What's that? Sue him? Yeah. He looks well, look good. at you. You're retching every time you think of orange juice. Well, it's my favorite drink. <laughs> Everybody sues over everything. I don't see why you can't get a little yeah, settlement. You're traumatized, aren't you? But my wife saved it, you know, and put it at the top. I go sit in the fridge right now. Oh. The maggots. <laughs> yeah. They're great. But, oh, God. It's gross. John's little fake throw-up session here might get him an extra couple hundred grand. Now, now I get his yeah. oh, yeah, mind thinking. Whatever. Yeah, I was thinking that, too. He's going like, it's oh, Howard, it was, oh, 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 oh. I'm not going to, I'm not going to sue, but I'm saying, it. Uh, no, it, uh, Howard, the thought of drinking maggots is totally disgusting. In fact, he never stuttered before he drank that orange juice. Why aren't you going to sue? You're so money-hungry, I don't understand why you wouldn't. Yeah, you could relax and... Keep Hardy off the road. <laughs> what are the damages? I got. I'm gonna say, you know. <laughs> <laughs> what are the damages? What are the, what are the damages? The fact that I'm about to throw up. <laughs> <laughs> I guess if I. Oh, Howard, I. You know, there. Can I say the company? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I can sue. I, uh, <laughs> oh, I can barely do my job. Uh, maybe there are damages. Well, I, I was doing the same thing last night. All right, I'll say the company. I don't want trauma <laughs> uh, What mental language? He's working up into the big lawsuit. Oh, I, 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 I don't know what my damage. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm no lawyer, but ah! <laughs> I did say the I can barely answer the phone. Ah! <laughs> 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 I don't know how I'm going to have lunch today. <laughs> and orange juice was your favorite drink. It is right? my favorite drink. And I, I, I swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> that is like the wet of gold dust. You know what, Artie? I swear to God, I'm not, I'm not kidding around. I swear to God. I can barely... <laughs> It was really disgusting. Uh, you probably have a lawsuit. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I can t I can show this tape. Yeah, you almost vomiting. Yeah, please. <laughs> Your Honor, when I think about it, I. <laughs> <laughs>
Ah, Your Honor. Your Honor. Your, your, your Honor, I can't even... <laughs> what are you doing, sir? I'm, I'm throwing up. <laughs> no, that's really gross, huh? <laughs> See, John, like this, Susanna, I'll pretend to throw up. You're out of your freaking mind. The e channel will have it on tape. <laughs> <laughs> that's Why? part of our evidence. That's uh, uh, really disgusting. That is gross. <laughs> Yeah. What, how would you... It was like a big lump of maggots. Oh. A bunch of them in the bottom of the... Uh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> that was, that was so Olivia <laughs> over here won't quit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was... Oh, my, it was maggots. <laughs> Howard. <laughs> Howard, off the air, I tried to tell you, sorry, wasn't I getting the same way? I'm not the goofing around. This guy... Well, you understand. Oh, you got to keep it up. This guy. No, that's gross. Ah, yeah. dude, how would you, you know what? Whether you're sick or not afterwards, I see people sue over everything. Yeah, it seems wrong that it should be in there, right? And you should be able to sue. June 5th is the date on it. June 5th. What's today? Today's like May 20th. Oh, so? Yeah. Well, they screwed up. Are you going to call Tropicana? Yeah, I told my wife at least call him. We'll get some free OJ out of it. Are you ever going to be able to drink OJ again? <laughs> I don't free think so. OJ. I don't think so. Free OJ. Yeah, that's a bad thing to say. Free Put that OJ. in context. Yeah, free OJ. <laughs> free OJ. <laughs> that's a good bumper sticker. What were you guys telling me about the road? Um, I don't know. During the commercial, you, I don't know. Something about we never finished the story. But, eh, what about the cab? Well, oh, how I couldn't get the... the uh, so, you know, they, they, they have my side next to Artie on the plane, uh, and Artie lifts the um, armrest. Right. <laughs> when I try to put it down, I couldn't get it down over, over his ass. <laughs> <laughs> his ass was on my side of the seat. <laughs> and I'll tell you, I'll tell you, that, that armrest hurt me. I think I got a lawsuit. <laughs> <laughs> Can I say to the airline? Continental. <laughs> It goes right back to the story, real casual. Yeah. Yeah, so it was Tropicana. Did your kids see it? No, but my kid's been sick all week. Oh. And she's been drinking the OJ. So oh. You know, she's had a tummy ache all week. Like, the whole family was Like all week, so now we think. That's, I mean, and that's true. <laughs> okay. But all of it's true. Did you right? you know, tape put away for all these little freaking. Right now, Greta's an acting. Right now, Greta's an acting class learning how to. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 you got to. When you when you, when you when you pretend to puke, you got to. No, 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 no. Now you try. Uh, <laughs> Tim, you're on the air. Hey, how you doing, guys? Welcome. Uh, I'm uh, from Central Ohio, and uh, unfortunately I had to work that night that uh, everybody was in town. And I uh, found out that everybody was going to something. Uh, hey, Bobo, you're on the air. Yeah, how you doing, guys? I think Audie and John are out of control, man. I mean, Audie, when was the last time you had a cholesterol test? Did you ever, you know your cholesterol? We don't uh, do that. Well, a couple of years ago, <laughs> it's got to be bad. It's got to be like 500. No, it's not that bad. It's got to be huge. It's not that bad. It's just bad. What's with, John, what's with John doing whippets, man? What's what? what? going to get brain damage. No, you're not. It's such a mild. I don't even understand that. It's a mild that. dosage. It's not you. So you said it costs you 10 bucks for three cans of whipped cream? <laughs> yeah, I said to the boy, I'd take everything in my wallet. and uh, Yeah, which was $10. Do you do the whippets right at the bar? <laughs> yeah. I mean, did, did they let you do that? Yeah, I mean, it's, not, it's not illegal. All right. It's, it's true. It's, uh, it's, his, it's a whipped cream can. Yeah, it's his whipped cream. <laughs> but you know what, Howard? He's getting bad because <laughs> the dosage wasn't enough, so I had to do two at a time. I don't know. I think I got brain damage. Can I say the name of the company? R Red Ready Whip. Ah! You're killing me! Ready Whip! You're killing me! Well, maybe, you know, this whole retching and everything is Ready Whip and not No, maggots. believe me. It was the brown maggots. maggots. Brown maggots. Yeah. Uh, you want to bring the jar in. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of maggots? <laughs> Brown maggots. Brown. I'm, I'm trying to just... Uh, so, I'm, I'm disconnected from the actual experience. You ought to bring it in. Is it a big lump of maggots? I'll bring in the... Uh, uh, I'll bring in the OG. I'll bring gross, in, man. I'll bring in the... Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I, I'm like... I, I can't eat bugs or anything like that. It really... Well, no one can. Yeah, who like, does? I can't eat bugs. <laughs> no, I'm, yeah, learning so much. I'm learning so much about John. You don't understand. 
really. No, but if you see Fear Factor, they can... can't eat bugs. <laughs> if you see Fear Factor, you know they, they can eat. Party eats bugs, Parmesan. So. Yeah, with a little mozzarella, not bad. <laughs> Yeah, you don't understand. I, I can't eat bugs. <laughs> I think I understand I'm that. Really I, I, we've all spied. No. <laughs> so are we. Are you goofing on us? <laughs> I'm not goofing on it, John. I just, you know, it doesn't really seem like you're throwing up. <laughs> I, could, I, I could probably throw up in two seconds thinking about it. What? I could probably throw up in two seconds thinking about Let's it. Let's see you do it. That'll be good for your yeah. lawsuit. I, 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 Come on, Brando. No, I, no I, <laughs> I don't want to throw up. I want to Talk about the maggots. Let's see if you puke. <laughs> if you puke, you'll have a lawsuit. Yeah. I swear That'll to God. Sick. Yeah. It's true. Talk about it. No. They will. <laughs> well, I'm telling you. You can't, you can't fake that, are you? Oh, you look like Ralph Cramden. <laughs> Talk about it. Seriously. If you throw up, you'll have a lawsuit. Yeah. I'm not kidding. I, 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 I'm not, I don't want to. Talk about, about the maggots and the orange juice. Talk, 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 no. So you drank a big gulp of it? I drank about three. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I think you're busy, dude. I mean, quarters and glasses. I'm telling you, this is what I was doing all last time. You know what I think about you, Gordon? I don't know. Jessica Hahn, you're on the air. Oh, lovely. I just got sick. I just literally got sick. <laughs> Listen, I did a drink of juice again. Listening to John's story. I just threw you could sue John, and John can sue <laughs> Tropicana. She, she could join the class lawsuit. action. Yeah, you could join the lawsuit. <laughs> I just got sick. I'm not even kidding. Oh, uh, 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 me too. Wait. Uh, 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 I'm in on the lawsuit too. Wait. You know, I throw, I throw up if my back didn't hurt so much from that kind of nasty. <laughs> All right, Jessica, thank you. <laughs> Jessica, checking in. Ryan, you're on the air. Good morning, Howard King of All Media. This is Ryan from Cleveland. Hey, Ryan. Listen, uh, I just want to say congratulations. You guys are on a great show every morning. You guys make us laugh. And, Thank uh, you. You're, you're doing real well, as usual, Howard. You're the man. Thanks. But uh, listen, as far as starring John goes in answering those phones, that douchebag smokes too much pot because he can't ever get to the phone. It rings <laughs> and rings and rings. It's 50 lines, dude. Dude, you're, John, seriously. Plus, I'm not even out there right now. It's, it's the whippets and the doobies, dude. You're a freak. Listen, <laughs> <laughs> didn't mention the beer. Uh. Seriously, you're you're. <laughs> Stupid, stupid, but that's right. We still love you. Do a great job. Congratulations, guys. Thank Take you. I should read email. I should get to Gary Garver did a bunch of interviews. Yeah, um, Gar you know, and I, I, I can't wait to play him because, Gar like, you know, you, you know, me and Gary get into an argument every morning over something ridiculous. Right. So this morning I said something about you know, one of Gary's interviews about, you know, one of the celebrities that I thought said, I think, I think he's mad at you for totally, like, a dumb reason. So I said that. And Gary's like, no, that's the, what, what? Well, you know, and he's like arguing with me because he doesn't think it's a dumb reason. But I do think it's a dumb reason. Uh, it's like every morning we have these like dumb. Why are you arguing with Gary Garver? What do you have to do? With no, Gary, Gary, Gary Delabate. Oh, Gary Delabate. Like, the last time we, we had this huge argument because I said I agree with you about the two hundred thousand dollars, you know, not being rich. We had this whole argument, in, 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 you know, in, in the office about it. So right. it's announced every time. So this time I just said. About the celebrity who's mad at you, I said, it's ridiculous. It is ridiculous. You know, and then he's like, no, it's not. Well, well, you know, so you know what happens, Howard? We don't have an argument. I disagree with John, but John can't be wrong. Well, that's, so well, that's well, an argument. No, no. I say, you know what, John? I don't agree with that. I think you're wrong. Oh, what are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay, guy. All right, Andy, you're on the air. I mean, Richard. Uh, yes, Richard. I'm, I'm currently with the Tropicana defense team. We've already worked on our defense regarding this pending lawsuit. Yes. Um, is it not true that he admits to eating uh, Chinese food prior to the orange juice? No. No, afterwards. Well, okay, well, you said the right, the... Uh, uh, this is going nowhere. Uh, I, th I think he's going to try and imply that there was <clears throat> rice in the, uh, in, the, in the orange juice. Oh, and you spit it into the orange It's just taking too yeah. long. Yeah, which is... Just say, you know what, the rice from your Chinese food probably got right. in the orange juice. That's not magus, that's rice. Right. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's go to Melrose Larry Green, then I'll play some interviews. Melrose... How are you, Howard? Okay. Great show. A couple of things. First of all, I ran into Sarah from Joe Millionaire the other night. You ran into Sarah from Joe Millionaire? Sarah. Sarah Kozer? Sarah Kozer, right. She's on the very cover unhappy. of Playboy, actually. She was in Playboy. First of all, she was very unhappy with a few things you said about her. What did I say nothing about her? Was, nothing was airbrushed, number one. Oh, that's a lie. 
the and that's uh, another girl. It's not Sarah. Yeah, I mean, I saw her in person. You know what? Let her get naked in here. Let me go, let me do an A B on that. Take it, please. Exactly. <laughs> then I, I said to her, "Are you ever going to go back on Howard? Because you know, I'm a big fan of the show." And she said, "Well, my plate is very full right now. I don't even think I have time to do his show." Her plate is full, which accounts for that belly being airbrushed. <laughs> Her, her plate is as full as Artie's. <laughs> Someone tells me. She's a, a nice. She's a she's a nice looking girl, but she the body. In fact, the guy Evan, who was Joe Millionaire, said to me, "Trust me, dude. She didn't look like that." I'm not done. She said she got a lot more than a half million dollars. She got closer to a million. I doubt that. That's what you told me. And she said that it was Fox's decision that Evan picked Zohar, or whatever the woman's name was. Oh, get out of here, Zora. I, why why does Fox you care? Life of my mother, she told me this. Why would Fox care who Evan picks? And since what he wasn't... she told me at a club in Hollywood. You think Fox wants to? What difference did it make to them who got picked? And plus, yeah, exactly, they want reality television. How well, would... well, between those two girls, what does Zora get you that Sarah doesn't? Nothing. Right. I have no idea. I'm just reporting. I'm like Jack Webb from Dragnet. All right, anything else? Yeah. Yes. I ran into Daniel Baldwin, the same place Gary Garver did. And Daniel Baldwin probably thought I had a tape recorder, but I did not. And he was talking to me very badly about you. Daniel Baldwin. Daniel Baldwin. Who is even, which one is Daniel Baldwin? The, the, one, one, who the one who tore the, up the hotel plaza. Room. Oh, the one who did the drugs? <laughs> yeah. Right. Well, who cares what he has to say about me? You want to know what he said? Yeah. He said, is he still on the air? Does he still have a career? Yeah, but no. Oh, that's he's just kidding oh, around. Oh, come on, Melrose. <laughs> that's what he said, Howard. Give us a break. He's making a and joke, Howard. Yeah. <laughs> Don't forget, ten o'clock is the E Show tonight. That's right, the E you Show. You make one good point. You finally got to something that actually makes sense. <laughs> They're running promos on eight. Yeah, ten o'clock. Our new time slot is ten o'clock, and the reason I mention this because you're going to want to see tonight's show. Tonight's show is the drinking show, and I think Miss Butterface. Yes. yes. Oh wow! You gotta watch it. Yeah, that's a better time slot. You know, cause ten o'clock. You think? Yeah, because people go to bed. I go to bed early. I like to go to bed early. Ten and eleven thirty. It's better for John. <laughs> Howard. Yeah. Well, you know, John doesn't like to eat bugs. <laughs> John's one of those whack jobs. Yeah. And he goes to bed early. Yeah. Ten o'clock is our new time slot on E. So there. Ten and eleven thirty for the second E show. Right. And, and uh, Howard? Yep. A, a, a warm regards to you from the whole LAPD over the weekend. They all, right, all right, Melrose, thank you. <laughs> you talked to the whole LAPD. Yeah. Steve, you're on the air. <laughs> okay. Steve? Yeah. Go ahead, you're on the air. What's that? <clears throat> I said you're on the air. <laughs> all right. Thank you, Steve. Hello? Yes. <laughs> yeah, hey, is it Howard? Yes, Steve. Yeah, uh, I was just listening listen to your show and uh, listening to John say that whippets aren't illegal under his camp and all that. I've been a cop for over 10 years and got news for him that aren't illegal. In a, wait, wait, in a whipped cream can? Yes, sir. Okay. Anything that's used outside of its express manufactured purpose is illegal. I mean, if you walked into a bar and you saw John sucking on a whipped cream can, <laughs> he would have to arrest him? You got it. We but do it all the time, with, uh, especially with uh, spray paint. But how do you know that I'm not sucking down the whipped cream itself? Well, brother, uh, okay. you could be sucking down the whipped cream, but it's it's going to change your uh, mm -hmm. your behavior. And you know yourself, you're not going to suck whipped cream out of a balloon, right? I think no, you'd it's have not a... out of a balloon. It's out of a, it's out of the whipped cream can. It's out. It's the actual can. Yeah, I think John's got you on that. So so then you so then you don't turn it upside down like you would when you normally remove whipped cream, right? What? You know, no, this guy, up, right? no, this guy's right. I mean, you, you do it, you have it in a different position. Right. right. I, can, I can put it in any position. It doesn't matter. The air's going to come out either way. Well. Okay. Yeah, but the whipped cream will come out one way. You don't want the whipped cream right. coming out, though. I don't mind yeah, at the end. The other way, all it comes out of the CO2. Right. It, it always comes out at the end. So you've arrested people for sucking on a whipped cream can? Yes, we have. We do it to junkies all the time to get information. Thank you. Yes, sir. Well, there's Steve the cop saying that John is probably going to go to jail. Good. Yeah, yeah. What are you in for, kid? Whip it. This is one junkie they won't get any information out of. Right. <laughs> I want to hear about my maggots. <laughs> Mike, you're on the air. Mike, you there? No, Mike. 
All right. Well, we tried. I got to take a break.